A student set up four clear sealed bottles. Each bottle was filled with five grams of aquatic plants and 500 milliliters of water. The student determined that the initial concentration of oxygen in each of the bottles was six parts per million. The bottles were then placed in environments that had the same temperatures but different light intensities. After 24 hours, water samples were removed from each of the four bottles. In this experiment, we will test the final oxygen concentrations in each of the bottles, do a little math to determine the net change of oxygen, and then verify that by testing the amount of carbon dioxide in the bottle. To test the amount of oxygen, we use the oxygen indicator. So first we drop one drop of oxygen indicator on each of the circles, and then we drop two drops of water sample from each of the bottles. Use the color indicator chart to determine the approximate parts per million amount of oxygen. Finally, you can test the carbon dioxide concentration using a carbon dioxide indicator. Replace one drop of carbon dioxide indicator and two drops from each of the bottle samples. Finally, you can calculate the final oxygen concentration and then verify that with the carbon dioxide concentration. We're going to place one drop of oxygen indicator and then place two drops for each water sample. So this is water sample, water from bottle number one. We're going to place two drops, bottle number two, bottle number three, and last but not least, bottle number four. Then we wait 15 seconds. Okay, it's been 15 seconds. We can record the value using the indicator. So for bottle number one, we want to compare the color. Bottle number two, also compare the color. Bottle number three, and then bottle number four. So bottle number two looks to be a yellowish green. So that's probably going to be somewhere between eight six and eight so then we can calculate our net change in oxygen and now we can test the amount of carbon dioxide by doing a similar test with the indicator we're going to put one drop of indicator on each circle and two drops of water from each bottle and this time we're going to be using the bottom indicator chart. We also wait 15 seconds and then check the color. So for one it says low, for two it's medium, and then for three and four it's high. Okay, that's it.